Orlando Wilson here, I'm waiting for a, another flight. I want to knock out a quick video reference uh, surveillance, counter surveillance, and being filmed. It's funny now, I'm outside of an airport filming. I don't want to film inside, I could. There's plenty of people doing it because I want to be polite. But I remember how many years ago, back in the day, if you were caught filming or taking pictures, videos, etc., anywhere near an airport, you're going to have big problems. The cops will be on you, etc. But these days, with everybody having cameras on their phones, cameras on their computers, cameras on their pads, etc., it's very difficult not to be filmed. Now, from a surveillance point of view, it makes life easier because, again, it's very easy to film people with a smartphone, with a phone with a decent camera on it. But when I'm selecting phones, I generally ensure that the camera has a wide angle um, zoom, a wide angle picture. That way, I don't have to point cameras directly at people to get them in the picture. You can simply ensure the videos on wide angle and video is always better than stills why you can always stop a video and take a stills picture from the video always uh, make sure the video is of the highest quality possible for the camera make sure you have an SD card in the camera so you can save all the footage and your phone's not going to get jammed up but as I talk about in other videos make sure nobody steals your camera or steals the SD card if it's sensitive footage etc so again, just pointing the camera generally in somebody's direction these days, um, you can pick up, generally pick up enough uh, detail and you can pick up who they're with, what they're doing, etc, etc, etc. So be wary from a counter surveillance point of view of anybody pointing a camera in your direction. And it doesn't have to be they've got the camera up in front of their face. They can have the camera down by their side. They can have the camera resting on the table. They can be facing the other direction with the camera on selfie like I'm doing now, filming you from behind. Um, or filming you with their back to you. So this is where you gotta be very wary if you're under any threat, if your clients are under any threat, if you're in the CP world. Um, anybody pointing cameras at your direction don't just look at the person, look, to, look at their phone and see if the camera is actually pointing towards you. And you know what, some people might do it by accident or there's nothing to it, move. And if the camera is still pointing at you or you see the same person later on and the camera of their phone is pointing in your direction, maybe you've got an issue. So always be wary of being filmed and these days it's difficult. So, one indicator if somebody's filming you is check where their camera on their phone is pointing. Move if you see the person again, or if they're following you with their, with their phone, then maybe you've got an issue. Then you need to have procedures in place to deal with that issue. Identify the person, etc., etc., or just snap a few pictures of them and uh, see what they do, right? 